We're back at Durham Town with a couple of homies. We got Sean Four, we got Blake Crochet, we got Greg Graff, we got old Caleb Landry. We're out here friggin' having some fun over here on the 12 point trail. Sean and Brock Engel are both A-class riders, so I'm attempting to do the very best that I can of keeping up with these fast fellows. Well, I'm not used to going very fast, so I'm attempting to dodge all these obstacles, mud holes, ruts, uh, weird sketchy line sections. Rock and Sean are here picking their noses waiting for me to catch up to them. So here's where the trail breaks. I think it's on A Trail. And the journey continues. Sean launched some schmegma at me as soon as I started to look competent. So kind of a bummer. I actually got a flat on 12 points so when we went to go break. Uh, Sean looked at my tires and he was like, what kind of tire pressure are you running? And I was like, uh, flat. <laughs> Brock thankfully had a spare wheel in the back of his truck, so we threw that puppy on, and we're back on the E section. I think this is E1. We're going to go take a quick spin through. I don't know how these guys ride so fast. I clench my sphincter any time I get above four feet, especially on the KTM. <laughs> I was excited because the forecast called for rain the entire week leading up to Saturday, and unfortunately we didn't get any friggin' rain. All we got was miserable heat, humidity, and dust later on in the day. find clips of me just riding by myself kind of boring so let's cut to the e-hill climbs we're gonna have some fun here some beautiful johnson took a bulldozer up and down these hills and made them way less awkward so uh, hats off to you fine sir I brought the camera in the backpack, so let's see if we can take some photos of the homies. I don't think Sean's front tire ever touched the ground the entire venture on the hill climbs, and here he is flipping me the phalange foreskin. The panda man's out here beaning up some moon dust. Clayton looks like a weatherman that can really twist the throttle on a dirt bike. Steve is out here looking competent until he blew his knee up in the moose trails. Greg's a nice guy that listens to divorced dad rock. I have duct tape on my shrouds and someone else's front tire on my bike because I don't know what I'm doing. Clayton and I had a sensual intimate moment going up the hill together and then we invited Sean and made it a three-way. I ended up getting blasted in the chest. You want to do it together? Same one. Same one. All right. Same one we did. Um, you want to go left, I'll go right. All right. All right. You ready? Ha ha ha! 
<laughs> do it again! <laughs> this fucking straight, do it again, dude! <laughs> One more time, baby! We got a good old boy in a four-wheeler, probably had too much Coors Light on his way out to the E hill climb section. Stuck in the mud. But here we are trying to convince Sean, Sean to wide, join us in our three adventure. Wide, three wide up the hill. Yeah, I want to take one of y'all down. <laughs> That's like a bad idea. <laughs> After the hill climbs, we hit the moose trails, and Sean is gone. The moose trails, I think, are Durhamtown's largest single track section, and they are in the furthest away part of the property, so anytime you hit these, you want to make sure you get a full tank, because you're going to be out there. I don't think much work ever gets done on them, so it's kind of perfect conditions for practice for nationals like Aonia GNCC. We're out here goosing in the moose trails, and then Greg just plops a load right on my face.
Thanks, Greg. You're welcome. Glad y'all got to avoid that deep hole. <laughs> no, dude. I hit it right after you fucked me up. You get stuck behind. It wasn't hard to get out. No. <laughs> But I couldn't wear my goggles. <laughs> yeah, like, look at the front of uh, Fred's bike. It's like, you're welcome. <laughs> yeah, you went like to the left. You went to the left.
<laughs> yeah. I tried to keep this video short and sweet, but I had a blast last Saturday. I thought we had a really good time, got some good riding in. It was hot as balls, but we made the most of it. Uh, if you are not subscribed to the channel, please consider doing so, so I can eventually make money. It won't be a lot of money. It'll be like a nickel per hundred views, but it'll help pay for new radiator shrouds. So, thanks for watching, and hopefully I'll have a new video out soon.